We're visiting with Dr. Eric Staffney, a fruit crop specialist at OSU. Eric, I'm really interested in learning about different systems of trellising grapes. We're going to be establishing some new grapes in our uh, studio, and I know you have several different systems. Could you tell us about a few of these and what are the advantages or uses? Right, right. In, in this uh, experiment station, we have three different trellis systems, or and it's kind of a training trellis system. So mm -hmm. the training goes along with the different trellis systems depending on the types of grapes. Okay. This first one that we have here is called the vertical shoot positioning system, mm -hmm. often referred to as VSP. Okay. This is a very commercial type of system, what a, a commercial vineyard would use if they're growing wine grapes. So this, this trellis system is designed mainly for growing European species Vitus vinifera grapes. So Vitus vinifera would be the Chardonnays, the Merlots, oh, the Cabernet grapes. Sauvignons, the wine grapes. And it's very obvious right off the bat that um, the, the vines branch out very low. And that's right. something, you know, normally we see them up higher. Yeah, one of the, one of the uh, benefits of having this low type of system is that it gives you the ability to grow upward. Mm -hmm. And so this species, these European species, want to grow in an upward fashion instead mm -hmm. of growing downward, which some other grape species would. So this way, you can take all that growth and move it upward. And then uh, when your fruit sets, it'll be in this range right mm -hmm. here. So it makes it very convenient to, to pick. Yeah. It makes it convenient to spray, and it makes uh, for good sunlight on the fruit. Yeah, a lot of sun exposure here. Right. And I see you're just weaving the branches as they grow up right here. Right. There. As okay. they start to grow, you just have to tuck them in and mm -hmm. make sure they stay in this area. Um, so it does take a, quite a bit of effort and labor to actually go and do that throughout the season. But you see the benefit of this. It makes a very nice, clean type of system. Certainly. Let's go take a look at another one. Great. Now this system I could see already has a little bit more of an open structure to it. What's the function of this style? Well, this system is called the Geneva Double Curtain. Mm -hmm. And it was developed in New York really for very vigorous varieties like Concord and some of the other American type grapes. And you can see that the, the arm wire, the cordon wire is higher. Yes. So this is mainly designed for American species of grapes which have a, a downward growth habit. Okay. And so it forms a curtain this way and goes down maybe to the ground. Okay. Um, this system is traditionally used for one vine comes up and it's split onto two different wires so that it can handle the more vigorous growth. Okay. Um, the middle section should be open to mm -hmm. allow for the sunlight penetration through there mm -hmm. and the airflow, airflow. Sure. all of that. Okay. Right. Excellent. And when we train these, we want to bring the, the trunk up to a top wire. Right. The yeah. training would be very similar mm -hmm. um, to some other systems, but you have to bring it up. Mm -hmm. uh, this, if you look at this one, this one is trained to one side and then you have long cordon arms. That's mm -hmm. one way to do it. Another way to do it is to bring it up and then split the vine to go okay. to each wire. And that's what this lower wire would be for in yes. the middle. You'd train it this to is that a, This point. is what we call a training wire. Okay. So it just makes mm -hmm. it much easier to get it up to this wire first and then move it on to the next one. Okay. The last system I wanted to look at is going to be the most practical for the home setting. Let's go right. look at how that one's organized. Okay. What's this system called? This system is goes by some different names. You can call it a high curtain system mm -hmm. or a high cordon system. And it's actually very similar to the first one that we looked at, the mm -hmm. vertical shoot positioning system, except that it's the opposite. So there, the vertical shoot positioning had a low cordon. This one has a high cordon. Because you're looking at, in this case, the downward growth 
instead okay. of the upward growth. So these are again more of the American or hybrid? More grade. of American or hybrid, although you can really grow just about anything on this. Okay. And you know, I could see from it, it's very simple. Um, we're training our, our vines to the top wire where it's going to spread out. I, I imagine this is a lot easier to uh, build in the backyard and possibly to maintain the vines as it well. It is. It's, it's much easier because you have fewer wires mm -hmm. and um, you can fit quite a few vines on there. You know, and training is, is not too difficult. You can use a bamboo stake like okay. this and tie it kind of to that stake and loosely and so that it keeps running up the stake. You can also use a string or twine to tie from here down to a stake mm -hmm. and also train it up this way. How long does it take the vine to reach the top wire? Usually it takes um, probably two years. Okay. In this case, these are planted in the spring of this year. Mm -hmm. So they're extremely vigorous. They can get, get up on this top wire in one year. Mm -hmm. um, it's fairly unusual. Okay. We're going to be planting, as I mentioned, some new grapes. So we'll, you'll have to join us again and show us how to uh, train, train our grapes. One thing I wanted to point out before we leave is I noticed all of your um, systems have uh, drip irrigation on the bottom. Right. And so in that case, we want to put an extra wire if we're going to drip irrigate. If you're going to drip irrigate, we, mm -hmm. we put the extra wire there because we mm -hmm. find that the animals don't chew on it. If it's on the ground, they tend to chew on it. If it's up off the ground, they don't. Okay, that's the whole purpose of raising the irrigation exactly. system. Wonderful. Well, thank you very much for uh, sharing with us today. I appreciate oh, you're welcome. It. Anytime. Mm -hmm.